welcome this is the energy vibration um, love reading for um, the Sagittarians Sagittarians okay Sagi so I see you Sagis are having fun this month some of you could be um, going overseas or yeah some of you Sagittarians are definitely going to be traveling and having a lot of fun okay I see some of you ladies are just um not really interested in love i see fun times overseas money is flowing um i see a lot of you are dating some of you could be meeting um people um and long distance i see a, a lot of you who are traveling for business is going to be dating other people i see some of you ladies who haven't been in a relationship for quite some time a lot of communication is happening and it's because of long distance relationships or people who are overseas trying to connect with each other people who are traveling overseas i see a lot of dating you're connecting with new people overseas so i see some of you are going to be who are dating is going to be meeting these really um rich men okay um uh, and you're going to be going out on a lot of dates with these men um these people are from past life okay so whether women or men i see you meeting these really financial um stable men that you're going to be meeting what's the message that is coming out make an effort to, to go out and meet others okay so I see that some of you have met someone who is financial stable and they're saying make the effort it's like okay I like the money but I really don't like the guy and they're saying make the effort okay um, new love is definitely going to be coming in and this new love is someone that you're going to be meeting um, who lives long distance or maybe a distance from you I see this person coming in I see a lot of you are going to be very attractive um, I see um, some of you could be getting married to this to getting married for money some of you could and, and this is what I was saying some of you have met someone who has money um, but there is no love and you know it's like your angels are saying look if you make an effort to love this person money and love can work okay so I see some of you are married and some of you marry for money but yet still you're dating other people and seeing other people okay so um, be aware of that because that's creating karma I see some of you are calling in your soulmate because some of you met someone overseas and it's as if you can constantly constantly thinking on that person and you want to know if that person is the right person for you okay I see a lot of you are going to be meeting people in overseas that is from your past life um, you could be traveling for work and you're meeting these people okay so um, when it comes on to marriages um, some of you want to get married there is definitely I see that some of you women who have been open and wishing to meet someone you're going to be meeting them very soon okay I see some of you are going to be meeting someone from a different nationality or background someone you've known in a past lifetime true love is definitely coming in so people who are dating you're going to be meeting um, someone from a past lifetime but this person is true love this person is coming from a good place this this person is very loving I see a lot of you as single ladies who are just depressed and um, are going to be reconnect reconnecting with your ex okay Ooh definitely you're going to be reconnecting with the ex I see some of you are going to be um, reconnecting with past love past life love um, and um, um, yeah you're gonna know right away that it is good 
most of you your relationship is based on money okay money is coming up I see a lot of you um, basically getting connected with people with money I see a lot of you are protecting yourselves it's like some of you went on vacation or you was you went out of town you met someone and you're kind of protecting yourself from this person you're very attractive and this person is very attractive to you but you're like I don't know I see some of you are protecting yourself because you were heartbroken so you are protecting yourself from heartbreaks again okay I see um, some of you are really going to realize that some you're in a loveless marriage okay I see some regret with a new love that is coming in and I see some of you are going to be calling in your soulmate I see a lot of conflicts if you have a long-distance relationship a lot of conflicts because you have an idea that maybe this person is not being very honest to you some of you are going to be meeting a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn woman um this woman is very very high class very super super good i see some of you could be really getting married to this person some of you are married to a young taurus virgo or a capricorn person but um you're wondering if that was the best decision i see you ladies are calling ladies 50 years and older you're calling in your soulmate and i see that your soulmate is overseas and I see you calling in your soulmate I see communication is going to be coming in because some of you realize that your soulmate is overseas and I see these these persons or these people are definitely going to be connecting with you I see a lot of you are going to be receiving news um, that if you were dating someone I see they are going to be letting you know that they're going to be in town so that is good I see long-term stability I see um, true love is coming in and I see long-term stability some of you who are married to a young Taurus Virgo or Capricorn I see that you were you know wondering if that was the right thing but I see just open your eyes because it's it's going to be working out okay sooner or later you singles were looking for someone I see some of you are going to be meeting a woman that is an Aquarius Gemini or Libra so sooner or later I see you meeting this person some of you are going to be meeting an Aries this Aries is someone from a past life however this person is coming in some of you want to reconnect maybe with an Aries that is from a past life I see you're going to be successful overcoming an issue um, some of you realize and some of you ladies who are sad and um, lonely is because uh, um, an Aquarian woman 50 years and older have entered your life I see some of you are having a new start and reconnecting with the ex or someone from a past life and you're really having a new start and this is going to be God so wonderful alignment of energies is coming up for you Sagittarians in um, this uh, this month of January because especially you Sagittarians a lady 50 years and older I see you having communication this communication could be coming in from someone overseas who you have met um, this person is really moving f fast coming towards you I see this person is pushing to um, live together that sort of a thing all right so you ladies 50 years and older a lot of communication text communication but this person is coming in fast it's like they want to get get settled down and they want to um, you know build a life with you I see they want to move in with you they're coming in but they're coming in very fast I see some regrets in um, some of you ladies 50 years and older had some regrets um, and, and heartbreaks and I see you kind of protecting your heart for some of you I see that some of you found out uh, that there was 
an Aquarius and Aquarius Gemini or Libra woman that was in your life it is going to be coming out so um, you women that is uh, um, housewives I see you're going to be finding out that the third party was an Aquarian okay a lot of you are protecting your heart a lot of you are not really focused in love and for the people who are focused with love I see reconnection is coming in I see some of you are deciding to go back to old love I see heartbreak squirrel and information coming in there is some heartbreaks and a lot of quarrel and conflicts and information is coming in but I see this is going to be yield as you come to the end of the month I see information coming out about um, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person and uh, Whoever this person is, I see you want to have a new start with this person and it is going to be happening because I see I see you pushing forward and uh, it is going to be happening. This new start and this new reconnection is going to be happening. So this is good. So, so people who are married, um, I see that some of you um, marry and it is only for money. Or some of you are considering um, to be to marry and it's going to be only for money I see some of you who have moved in with a young Taurus Virgo or Capricorn um, it is your true love and I see you're wondering but it's okay all right whoever this person is um, this this person is okay it's good but um, some of you could be finding out that uh, your uh, your partner is with a young Taurus Virgo or Capricorn you're going to be finding this out it could be a Virgo you're going to be finding this out okay so be aware of that it is really a challenging time for love I did say that to you guys that this year um, for you Saji is going to be very challenges there is conflicts I see regrets with a new love um, this person some of you were having fun with um, regrets with that relationship and it could be with a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn because you realize that they were seeing a younger Taurus Virgo or Capricorn or your partner um, was seeing another younger Virgo or Capricorn I see past life relationships is coming in and I see information is coming in okay and a lot of you um, men could be really connecting um, with another fire sign person so this is coming in I'm saying new start is coming up especially with people you want to reconnect with a past love and you realize that this person is basically the person for you and you want to reconnect with this person so there's a not a lot of you know the exes coming back I see a lot of you are looking um very attractive some of you are attracted to a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person very attractive person whoever this person is um communication is key some of you women are having conflict in your relationships women 50 years and older whether you're married or um, I see you having a lot of conflicts in your relationships I see recon um, reconnection whether with an ex or a past love is coming in and this could be someone from a different culture race or creed okay so um, that is coming up but this month is like a lot of communication is coming in whatever is transpiring I see positive alignment of energies and I see um, a lot of you I don't know what is transpiring but it has to do with something um, where you could be meeting people who are financial stable or you yourself is financial stable and you see that people are more attracted to you for whatever the reason is so Saji, I love you guys. If you want to see the extension of this reading, you need to um, check out the website to receive the extension of this reading. And I want to say namaste until next time.